subject to paragraphs 2 and 3 below by a majority of 10 to 5 within uh, parenthesis Justice Ijazul Essen, Justice Munib Akhtar, Justice Sayyid Mazahir Ali Akbar Nakwi, Justice Aisha A. Malik and Justice Shahid Wahid dissenting. Bracket close. The Supreme Court Practice and Procedure Act 2023 is sustained as being in accordance with the Constitution of the Islamic Republic of Pakistan and to this extent the petitions are dismissed. Paragraph 2. By a majority of 9 to 6, Justice Ijazul Essen, Justice Munib Akhtar, Justice Yaya Afridi, Justice Sayyid Mazahir Ali Akbar Nakwi, Justice Aisha A. Malik, and Justice Shahid Waid dissenting, right close, subsection 1 of section 5 of the Act, within brackets, granting a right of appeal prospectively, is declared to be in accordance with the Constitution and to this extent the petitions are dismissed. Paragraph 3. By a majority of 8 to 7, within bracket Chief Justice Qazi Faiz Issa, comma, Justice Sardar Tariq Masood, comma, Justice Sayyid Mansoor Ali Shah, Justice Aminuddin Khan, Justice Jamal Khan Mandukhel, Justice Athar Minela, and Justice Musarrat Hilali dissenting, subsection 5 of the Act, within brackets, a right of appeal retrospectively is declared to be ultra vires the constitution and to this extent the petitions are allowed. Your bill 2023. Uh, first of all apologies for being late but the matter was a bit technical. I will talk about it in Urdu. First of all, thank you very much for your support. You have done good for us. And then I will be very Pakistan Television ka bhi shukriya da karna chata hoon ke unho ne ye humara jo pilot project tha usko kamyaab banaya aur ap me se kisi ne firmaya tha ke shayad humari rating cricket se better hain to shayad is comment discontinue karna padhe aur shayad apni karna ho achcha ye zara sa technical tha is liye zara vakht laga to mein pehle आज का वो जो आज की बात हुई वो पढ़ देता हूँ और फिर आज का ऑर्डर। The Attorney General of Pakistan has concluded his submissions in support of the constitutionality of the Supreme Court Practice and Procedure Act 2023 within brackets the Act. Learned Mr. Hassan Irfan Khan for the Petitioner and Constitution Petition Number 19 Oblique 2023. Learned Mr. Mohammad Ikram Chaudhary for the Petition. Constitution Petition Number 20 or 23, and learned Mr. Abid S. Zubairi, President of the Supreme Court Bar Association, exercised their right of reply and were heard. These petitions were heard by the full court on 18 September, 3rd, 9th, 10th, and 10th uh, October 2023, and are today disposed of in terms of the order of the court. And this has been signed by all of us. Uh, and now I shall read the order of the court. For reasons to be recorded later, these petitions are decided as under. And if you don't get it, it's all right. We'll have it uplinked on the website and, uh, today. Subject to paragraph paragraphs 2 and 3 below, by a majority of 10 to 5, within uh, parenthesis, Justice Ijazul Essen, Justice Munib Akhtar, Justice Sayyid Mazahir Ali Akbar Nakwi, Justice Aisha A. Malik and Justice Shahid Wahid dissenting. Bracket close. The Supreme Court Practice and Procedure Act 2023 is sustained as being in accordance with the Constitution of the Islamic Republic of Pakistan and to this extent the petitions are dismissed. Paragraph 2. By a majority of 9 to 6, Justice Ijazul Essen, Justice Munib Akhtar, Justice Yaya Afridi, Justice Sayyid Mazahir Ali Akbar Nakwi, Justice Aisha A. Malik, and Justice Shahid Waid dissenting, right close, subsection 1 of section 5 of the Act, within brackets, granting a right of appeal prospectively, is declared to be in accordance with the Constitution, and to this extent the petitions are dismissed. Paragraph 3. By a majority of 8 to 7, Within bracket, Chief Justice Qazi Faiz Issa, comma, Justice Sardar Tariq Masood, comma, Justice Sayyid Mansoor Ali Shah, 
جسٹس امین الدین خان جسٹس جمال خان مندوخیل جسٹس اتھر منیلا اینڈ جسٹس مسرت ہلالی ڈسینٹنگ سب سیکشن فائیو آف دا ایکٹ ود ان بریکٹس گرانٹنگ اے رائٹ آف اپیل ریٹروسپیکٹیولی از ڈکلیئر ٹو بی الٹرا وائرس دا کانسٹیٹیوشن اینڈ ٹو دس ایکسٹینڈ دا پٹیشنز آر الاؤڈ سو آئی ہوپ دیٹ کلیریفائز دا میٹر اینڈ وی ٹرائی ٹو ڈو اٹ ان دا شارٹسٹ پاسبل ٹائم اینڈ you have the benefit of the order of the court and now we will take time to write the detailed reasons once again ladies and gentlemen thank you very much and members of the press thank you to them as well from all of us hopefully for accurate reporting <laughs> very grateful Shall now well deserved rest i will get ji ji thank you thank you shall read the order of the court for reasons to be recorded later these petitions are decided as under and if you don't get it it's all right we'll have it uplinked on the website and uh, today subject to paragraph paras 2 and 3 below by majority of 10 to 5 within uh, parenthesis justice ijazul ehsan justice munib akhtar Justice Sayyid Mazahir Ali Akbar Naqvi, Justice Aisha A. Malik and Justice Shahid Wahid dissenting. Bracket closed. The Supreme Court Practice and Procedure Act 2023 is sustained as being in accordance with the Constitution of the Islamic Republic of Pakistan and to this extent the petitions are dismissed. Paragraph 2. By majority of 9 to 6, Justice Ijazul Ehsan, Justice Munib Akhtar, Justice Yaya Afridi, Justice Sayyid Mazahir Ali Akbar Naqvi, Justice Aisha A. Malik, and Justice Shahid Waheed dissenting, right close, subsection 1 of section 5 of the Act, within brackets, granting a right of appeal prospectively, is declared to be in accordance with the Constitution, and to this extent the petitions are dismissed. paragraph 3 by a majority of 8 to 7 within bracket chief justice qazi faiz isa comma justice sardar tariq masood comma justice sayyid mansoor ali shah justice aminuddin khan justice jamal khan mandukhil justice athar minilla and justice musarrat hilali dissenting sub section 5 of the act within bracket stating a right of appeal retrospectively is declared to be ultra vires the constitution and to this extent the petitions are allowed so i hope that clarifies the matter and we try to do it in the shortest possible time and you have the benefit of the order of the court and now we will take time to write the detailed reasons once again ladies and gentlemen thank you very much and members of the press thank you to them as well from all of us hopefully for accurate reporting <laughs> very grateful now well deserved rest i will get <laughs> 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 thank you thank you <laughs>